In May, the U.S. economy created 223,000 new jobs while the unemployment rate fell to a new post-crisis low of 3.8 percent, according to the latest release from the Bureau of Labor Statistics. According to estimates from Bloomberg, non-farm payrolls were expected to grow by 190,000 while the unemployment rate was forecast to remain at 3.9 percent in May. Wage gains were also better than expected in May, as average hourly earnings rose 0.3% over the prior month and 2.7% over the prior year. Economists had expected that wages would grow by 0.2% and 2.6% over last year. Many economists have said they'd expect wages to be rising by a faster rate given the low level of unemployment. Ahead of Friday's report, President Donald Trump tweeted, Looking forward to seeing the employment numbers at 8.30 this morning. The president and a few top advisors typically get access to the jobs report the evening before it is released to the public. In May, the construction industry added 25,000 jobs, the most of any goods-producing industry. Overall, goods-producing industries saw 47,000 jobs created during the month. Education and health services saw the biggest gains in May, with 39,000 new jobs created in this industry. May's gains were broad-based across sectors, however, with just three industries seeing overall job losses. The labor force participation rate, which has remained stubbornly low since the financial crisis, hit 62.7% in May, a 0.1% decrease from the prior month. Miles Udland is a writer at News Pulse Finance. Follow him on Twitter at Miles Udland.